wise wisdom from Proverbs chapter 7. Dear friend, do what I tell you. Treasure my careful instructions. Do what I say and you'll live well. My teaching is as precious as your eyesight. Guard it. I like that. Write it on the back of your hands. Etch it on the chambers of your heart. Talk to wisdom as a sister. Treat insight as your companion. They'll be with you to fend off the temptress, that smooth-talking, honey-tongued seductress. As I stood at the window of my house, looking out through the shutters, watching the mindless crowd troll by, I spotted a young man without any sense arriving at the corner of the street where she lived and turning up the path to her house. It was dusk, the evening coming on, the darkness thickening into night. Just then, a woman met him. She'd been lying in wait for him, dressed to seduce him. Brazen and brass she was, restless and roaming, never at home, walking the streets, loitering in the mall, hanging out at every corner in the town. She threw her arms around him and kissed him, boldly took his arm and said, I've got all the makings for a feast. Today I make my offerings, my vows are all paid. So now I've come to find you, hoping to catch sight of your face. And here you are. I've spread fresh, clean sheets on my bed, colorful imported linens. My bed is aromatic with spices and exotic fragrances. Come, let's make love all night. Spend the night in ecstatic lovemaking. My husband's not home. He's away on business. He won't be back for a month. Soon she has him eating out of her hand, bewitched by her honeyed speech. Before you know it, he's trotting behind her, like a calf led to a butcher shop, like a stag lured into ambush, and then shot with an arrow, like a bird flying into a net, not knowing that its flying life is over. Verse 24. So friends, listen to me. Take these words of mine most seriously. Don't fool around with a woman like that. Don't even stroll through her neighborhood. Countless victims come under her spell. She's the death of many a poor man. She runs a halfway house to hell, fits you out with a shroud and a coffin. Wow, some really wise words from Proverbs chapter 7. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. You can contact me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. I hope you have a blessed day living for Him.